Javier Builds a Bridge, Chapter 7, Joe Weighs In. Somehow we managed to pull Abuelito and Abuelita away from the crowd to show them the bridge we had built. Mama and Joe joined us. They huddled around the bridge as we demonstrated its strength. Interesting, Joe nodded and smiled. How'd you come up with this idea? Well, I began, Luisa's drawing reminded me that there are trees near the riverbanks, trees we can use as the towers of a suspension bridge. The suspension bridge was Manny's idea. All we need is rope, strong rope, Jennifer said. Or maybe metal chains, Manny added. Then we make a real bridge that will be stable enough for Luisa and me to cross. I think we can even use the rope and plank bridge we already have to make the road bed. We'll just hang it so it will be nice and straight and steady. And to make the railings or something for the side so no one can fall off, Jennifer said. Abuelita clapped her hands. Abuelito patted me on the back. Mama said quietly, well, how about that? Manny and Jennifer chattered, explaining how we tested our ideas. But Joe was quietly scratching his head, thinking, thinking. What would he say? I held my breath. <gasps> Joe, I asked, not wanting to wait any longer. This is a really neat idea, he began slowly, as I waited with a pounding heart. I think... He looked serious and paused. Then with a big grin, he said, I can't wait to start building. Joe promised to help me figure out an exact plan for the real bridge, including how much chain we would need. Then we would build a first version, which Joe called a prototype, together. And if it doesn't work just right, Joe cautioned, we'll have to improve it until it's okay. No using the new bridge until it's safe. Deal? Deal, I said. What a great idea you and your cousins had, Javi, Mama said. No, Mama. It wasn't just us, I corrected her. It was us and my sister. The trees were her idea, right, Luisa? Luisa grinned back at me.